How y'all doing? You know I'm light skinned in the Scorpio, I might start crying and shit. <laughs> um, first of all, thank you to Joy Brown and Culture Creators. This is fa uh, fabulous, magnificent, um, necessary, so give her a round of applause. I appreciate you, Joy. Y'all know I could turn up any moment and make everybody feel like the one, but for me to talk about me, it's a lot. So here we go. Um, we front like this is whatever when we get honored um, at these award shows by our people. But I want to tell you, this is the most important award that I've received in my almost 50 years. Um, I like to thank the Almighty uh, in which all of my light and blessings are secured. I like to thank my wife, Jessica, and my children, uh, Kenny and Kyle, for reminding me daily of my... <clears throat> of my why. Um, I'd like to thank my mom, the original lifestyle specialist. <laughs> um, I think the, uh, the one that keeps yelling, my brother Leo Williams. <laughs> we are uh, six months apart, and uh, we've been together ever since. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with me. This ain't even me. I'm like, I'm like Jay Valentine. I like to fight. I'm that light-skinned nigga. Um, I like to thank my sister, Robin Lyon, who got an award unexpectedly tonight. She's been with me since she was 13 years old. I met her in my room with one of my great friends giving her a hickey, and we've been <laughs> best friends. I gotta say some shit to get me out of the emotional stage. <laughs> I'm gonna be all right, I'm gonna be all right. Uh, Wendell White, uh, the first BMF, uh, he, you like that? Um, my best friend who saw me along with DJ Clark Kent actually put me in position to get some money because of my superpower. And then Andre Harrell, may he rest in peace, one of the greatest culture guys to ever walk this earth for teaching me how to use that superpower. Uh, you see, in this, this, this thing of ours, we, we're not often told that we're special or have a gift. We are sucked dry for that gift without reward. But I never walked to Brooklyn for cheesecake. <laughs> and I pride myself on setting the table for others not to do the same. Um, we had to figure a lot of this out on our own. Trial and error is the best teacher, and I'm sure many educated people in this room know that school cannot teach you what life presents you. Um, I've had a lot of lessons, more lessons than wins, but those wins were some motherfuckers. And um, many of us shared a lot of moments together, many drunken nights, celebrating life the way we should because we're not supposed to be here. Many of us are not, especially myself. But I want to give you a few inspirational moments, and I want you to digest this. I got locked up at 18 years old. I'll be 50 in October, and I've never been back. Um, fuck. Y'all got a shot of some Deleon or some shit? I met my wife uh, 23 years ago. I'm sorry, 25 years ago, and we're celebrating our 23rd anniversary this October. I have two black boys that are great humans. <clears throat> I ain't really on the industry shit, and y'all know that, but I'm so thankful for <clears throat> all of the people, all of the people I've had the pleasure to work with in this room, Shari, to see you grow from, I'm talking about, I thought you were this tall when we worked at Rockefeller, but you would run around with so much energy and to be president a Rock Nation, I'm so proud of you, but a lot of mentees here. Larry Morrow from New Orleans, I have a lot. Earn your leisure, who's coming up. My brother Tank, but I just, I can't celebrate myself and I don't know why, but I did some great shit in my life. Um, I love y'all. I just want you to never let your expectations exceed your effort. Never let your expectations exceed your effort. What you put into this, I promise you will get out. Duh.